John Buck O'Neill got a start as a first baseman in the Negro Leagues, primarily for the Kansas City Monarchs. After his playing days were over, he went on to become the first African-American head coach of the MLB for the Chicago Cubs. One of his biggest claims to fame is signing Hall of Famers, Lou Brock and Ernie Banks to their first contracts. His other two big contributions to baseball include leading the effort to establish the Negro League Baseball Museum in 1990 and his compelling stories about the Negro Leagues for Ken Burns' 1994 baseball documentary. In the year 2006, Buck was one of many players being considered to be added to the Hall of Fame. Unfortunately, he didn't receive enough votes. But this year might just be a shot. The Negro League was nothing like Hollywood trying to make it. The Negro League was the third largest black business in this country. All you needed was a bus, and we rode in some of the best buses money could buy. Yeah, and a couple of sets of uniforms, you could have 20 of the best athletes that ever lived. 